Hey everyone, we are back with more inscription. I don't think we can go up there. We can go around here. Another one of these, right? Minus five to start with. Oh, okay, that was easy. Comparatively. What if I just cut off the minus three to start with? Look at that, we did it! Okay, so... There's more to this place. Boy, mate, I know what you're here for. You're asking me to take a dive. I can't accommodate you, mate. Got special orders, isn't it? Looking to dredge something special. We can duel. I maybe even give you something if you win. I can't be taking a dive. PF3 will understand it. Oh, he's got a dive card. Great. Know what, mate? Can't take my eyes off my work yet. I'll give you this one. Oh. Yeah, take your pack. <laughs> that was funny. I like that. Ooh. Double gunner. But we'll strike each space, holding the left and right of the spaces across from it. That could be good to stick in there. It costs six, but like, again, another late game card. No, off with you. I need concentrate. Oi! Is that? I feel like he's gonna reward me big for this one. A few things popping up on the screen there, and I was like, what the hell is that? Shutter bug there. How do I get out of here then? We just go back over here and yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. What about shutter bug? No, this is not a PMAT deck. This is a uh, robot deck. Guys, I challenge you, I, I task chat with coming up with inscription cards, but a deck for Piamat. The bots haven't gotten much better, but you battled all of my workers, and you actually won. Give me that deck again. Wow, I beat them with that. Alright, maybe there are some synergies that I missed. Let's go then. Right, let's see if I can beat this guy. Oh fuck, okay. Uh, this is... You see those conveyor belts? Just like in my factory, at the very least, they ought to test your lane positioning. Oh, I'm terrible with this, so this is... This gonna be fun. Okay, so it brings it over to his side. So, see how that works? Okay, your turn. Less than ideal, I don't have anything I can play. What? Okay. Still don't have anything I can play. Can't break it. Uh, okay, I see. I see how it works. 
I should stop being terrible at lane positioning, you're right. Nothing I can do. But we're done. Yeah, that was a given. You open the crates around the temple, right? You need better cards. Try that again now that I got an idea of how it works. You go first. I passed. It's your turn. Okay, so there's honestly nothing I can currently do except wipe out all three of his cards, so... <laughs> Thank you for the mantis gods, guys. I need something that will generate bones for me, though. So I don't want to do this, so what I'm thinking I'm going to do here is uh, we're going to sacrifice him. Oh, scanner's online. Which card to scan? Just kidding. Obviously the one with the best stats. The stat line could be better. Oh, fucking hell. Your move. Hmm. I could hit him once and then kill that one. But that one's gonna die anyway from this guy. But I won't get any damage. And he'll get another card. Honestly, I think we should kill it. What are you laughing at? Nice luck you had! I guess playing a perfect game is no match for good RNG. Fuck you, robot. I guess you won. Your ambition is to become the scribe of de the dead? That naive spinster. You ought to reconsider. I actually like the robot deck, it's pretty good. The Gem Fiend's owner controls... If the Gem Fiend's owner controls no Mox cards, Gem Fiend perishes. Oh, okay. If Mage People's owner controls no Mox, all Mage Pairs. Okay. When the opposing creature is placed opposite of the enemy, both one may move and move. Okay, why are these ones always so expensive? 
called well, the unlocks modules on board. It provides a green, orange, and blue gem to its owner. After attacking, Skelemagus perishes. Also, Skelemagus owner controls no unlocks cards, Skelemagus perishes. Oh, okay. Let's check out this guy. The note reads, Greetings! If you are reading this, it must be because you wish to challenge me, Magnificus, to a card battle. But in order to earn my privilege, you must first defeat my three graduate students. And for their whereabouts, that is for you to discover. Sincerely, Magnificus. Okay. Okay, we don't know what that is yet. Let's take a look around. Explore a little. There's a door there that's closed. Strange monocle. You put it on. Oh, what is this? Okay, skull. Flying skull. My organs are melting. Do you see? My nephew can start me into goo for my final exam. I just need to fit one more challenger, then I will earn my rightful place. My rightful place in the deck of the master is one of his prize cards. Arr! Nothing will stop me. Okay, uh. I'm gonna drop you here, sacrifice you for this. There, and I'll put you on the board over here. Okay, okay we got two energy, so I'll drop you there. There, okay, and I got rid of the dude who's giving these guys attack power, so I thought that might be what happens. We got two bones, so let's toss you out here. Just so that we can get some more damage on the board. Okay. Start spending these foils. I got enough of them, eh? Ew! Pillars! Pillars! Just told the master I passed! You won't know the difference. Here, take this pack. Hmm. Master Orlu. Airborne. Also, when Master Orlu deals damage directly, draw a card for each damage dealt. That could go through your uh, your deck really fast. Uh, can't be talked about. While Emerald Knox is on the board, it provides a green gem to its owner. Oh, what is this? Oh, adders are, are decent. Yeah, I can open the door for you. Oh. Let's see what's over here. There's a chest chest there I gotta open too, but I wanna see what this guy sells. What is this? Hey, three energy? Okay, I don't care about that. Is this? Oh, it's just like a list of my collected cards. That's kind of cool. Okay, so I should probably update my deck. I mean, I could, but at the same time, I'm gonna go see if I can. Oops. What's this? Uh, you found us here. This is good. This is good. 
Ooh, we require, we require, we require duplicates. Do you see the diagram? Two of that. Thank, thank you. Oh, you have the cards? Yeah, sure, all right. This is good, close your eyes. This will be gruesome. Thank you, here is your prize. Spore Digger. At the end of the owner's turn, Spore Digger will generate one burn. Burn, bone. Also, at the end of the owner's uh, turn, Spore Digger will generate one bone. Okay, so I get two bones. Oh, I don't have those. Okay. Well, let's put a Spore Digger there. Actually, you no, know, we don't need another one else. Uh, let's put another energy card in there. I was thinking of putting one of these, uh, another one of these little dudes in there, or maybe one of these guys. They have pretty decent stats. Or, potentially, one of these guys. They take a lot more, but they'll be like another good endgame card, because they can hit two spots. They're also kind of weak, because they only have one health. Maybe I'll try this dude here. This is very Mario esque in its presentation, by the way, when you're walking around that area. Where was the cellar dude? Trapper? I can get an Ouroboros card. Ouroboros is always generally pretty good, right? He gets stronger every time he dies. Not sure what I should spend my foils on yet. Let's go check out a few more of these battles and then we'll we'll make a decision. The inside of this house is covered in a sticky green goo, but you find a card back. Spend your foils on pizza? Mmm, pizza. Somebody stares lifelessly back at you. Then suddenly it springs into motion. Oh. Okay. What is this? If a creature would attack Force Mage, it does not. Out this dude here. I should have put him out on the first down. Oops. Oh well. He's gonna take five energy, so we can't put him out yet. Uh, I can send out this guy though. Oh, no, I don't have enough bones yet. Okay, I only have one bone. There. Now we can send it out. I'm supposed to send a skeleton. I think I'm gonna put out the uh, the zombie for now. Okay. The dummy's hinges creak back into position, and it returns to its lifeless stare. Fight it again? Okay, shit. Ah. All right. Spell marker than arm. 
Oh, I wasn't paying attention to what you were saying there. That's gonna cost four, so it doesn't help me, but... No point in getting rid of him for the Mantis card. This is gonna, gonna do two damage anyway. And now we can summon this guy. And this guy. I could farm that guy for foils, I guess. <laughs> Where did you get the code for that? Oh, I didn't even notice. Just imagine you are an ice cube slowly melting on a hot pan. Oh, I was only talking to myself. The pain of being I had impaled on a spear is, well, is worth it. Worth it, of course. Magnificus will award me the highest honor. I'll be the centerpiece of his deck. Hmm. Okay, so we're going to. Uh, off with our usual and see if this is a good play. That's fine. I don't have enough bones yet, so we're just gonna go. These are ruby mocks. Damn. Okay, that didn't work out as well as I hoped, but uh, I can at least do this. wipe him out again. Okay. Uh, I don't really want to get rid of the little robot dude there. Because he can kill that. But it might be worth it to get the wolf on the board to do so. Uh, so I think I'm going to do that. Honestly, we may as well because points. Got him. Okay. Hmm. Perhaps I will not be sent to central to this strategy. I cannot. He can use me as a chump blocker. I am master disappointment. Take this pack. Yeah, I don't really like what I've read of the, uh, wizard cards yet. Go. Alright, what's up here? Oops, I don't mean to go back downstairs. Alright. The note reads, the top sigil is found by the greedy. Okay. The bottom sigil is found by the hard of hearing, or by those who hear too easily. The middle sigil is found by the pale. The skull. The rabbit. 
cabin. So the greedy would be the rabbit. I didn't mean to do that. So I think the, uh... So this one's Rabbit. The bottom one is the Skull, I think? Middle one is the Pale, so I think that's the Skull. That's incorrect. Alright, let's make this one the skull. I thought the top one would have been a rabbit, because it was a rabbit card inside there. A sigil where the card used to be. Oh, okay. You gotta reach in for more. That makes sense. Last stimulation! My test has been sensory deprivation, as you see, to unlock the full potential of my mind, you see. It's unlocked now. Hear me, Magnificus? I'm ready! We have to battle, okay? Uh, gem feed requires mox cuts to exist and therefore dies. <laughs> yeah, something hilarious about that. Okay. Alright, let's, uh... Sacrifice you. And I'm gonna put up the, uh... Grave digger. I probably could have done that one turn sooner, you're right, but... incredibly stimulating. We aren't done here, right? I wish to see the light again, to, to sing, to dance. You wouldn't leave, would you? Yes, I would. Ah. Oh. They're added to my collection. If I open the door, you'll stop by on the way back and let me out. Right? Yes, that's what we'll do. Alright, we're gonna take a break and then we're gonna go into the last 30 minutes of today's stream, guys. <laughs> 